In regards to our announcement last night regarding the high altitude surveillance balloon, I'm not going to have much new information to provide other than to say that the North American Aerospace Defense Command continues to monitor it closely. While we won't get into specifics in regards to the exact location, I can tell you that the balloon continues to move eastward and is currently over the center of the continental United States. Again, we currently assess that the balloon does not present a military or physical threat to people on the ground at this time, and we'll continue to review, or excuse me, continue to monitor and review options. First of all, we are aware of the PRC's statement. Um, however, the fact is uh, we know that it's a surveillance balloon, uh, and I'm not going to be able to be more specific than that. Uh, we do know that the balloon has violated U.S. airspace and international law, uh, which is unacceptable. And so we've conveyed this directly to the PRC at multiple levels. Uh, and in terms of specific locations, uh, I'm not going to be able to go into specific locations again, other than to say it's moving eastward at this time. Uh, we do assess at this time that it does not pose a physical threat, as I mentioned, uh, to people on the ground. Uh, so we'll just leave it at that. Jennifer. You say that it's moving eastward and it's over the continental U.S. It's, it's not over Montana anymore. Is the Chinese government controlling the movement of the balloon or is it just floating with uh, airstreams? Thanks, Jennifer. Uh, so I'm not going to go into uh, any specific intelligence that we, we may have. Again, uh, we, we know this is a Chinese balloon um, and that it has the ability to maneuver, um, but I'll just leave it at that. And once it's over a body of water, will you shoot it down? Uh, again, right now we're monitoring the situation closely, uh, reviewing options, but beyond that, I'm not going to have any additional information.